Today on Furtado Racing, I bought a fresh set of tires for my rims, so I thought this would be a great time to repair some curb damage that I have and to give the rims a fresh coat of paint. So let me show you how. Now that we got our paint proof finally set up and our rims inside, we've put masking tape over the areas that we don't want paint on, and we've put cards along the outside of the rim to stop any overspray getting on the tires. So let's go ahead and get started. So I started by painting the barrels of the rims first. I did this because they take the most amount of paint. Also, once I flip it over, it's easier for me to see how many more cans of paint I'll need to finish the spokes. So by looking at this, the inside needs about one more coat. So I'm gonna go ahead and get to it. So that way I can get these bad boys finished. So since I didn't take the camera with me into the paint booth, I thought I would go over how I went about painting the faces of the rims to avoid overspray and runs on the spokes. When doing this, I first started off by painting the sides of the spokes first. Doing that all the way around the rim and then going back the opposite way and getting the other sides done. By doing this, you get the side of the spoke done first and the overspray gets everything done on the top face. Same with the bolts. I did the bolt holes first to make sure they had all coverage throughout and then the overspray handles the inside of the hub there. Did that for two coats. And then my final one was just an overall top coat to give myself the nice finish. Now that the paint is fully cured, we're almost done. What I like to do as a final step is put a coat of wax on the rims to help protect against the corrosive brake dust. What I like to do is put three coats on, that way you know nothing's gonna happen to it. All right, the rims are finally done. I like to take this time to go over the process and how I did it. To start, I ground down all of the curb damage on all of the lips with a file. After that, I wet sanded all of the rims with 400 grit sandpaper. After the rinse and drying, I brought them into the paint booth and painted them flat black. I skipped the primer process on this one, but I tried to make up for it by using three coats of wax on as a protectant from brake dust and other stuff. The rear rims have the Michelins on them. The fronts still have the Continentals. That's gonna change in the summer when I get my Michelins for the front. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. And please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.